Hey cookies, welcome back to another video and today we have my fidgets. Bum bum bum. Okay, and um, I'm gonna be reading them because I figured out that I actually don't have a video on that. Also, I have, I kind of have a fidget on my phone, it's a pop socket. Sounds good. Sound is great. It's, it's... It keeps me fidgety with my phone. Also, I have a label on my phone that says my name. That keeps me fidgety a lot. Anyways, um, here are my actual fidgets that I have in a cereal. Okay, anyways. I'm going to be writing them. So, let's start off with this. Okay, to be honest, this is my favorite fidget now. Um... I, um, well, okay, so, I love the color, I absolutely love the color, it's darker on screen than it is in real life, but I love just the light blue, and then it turns pink, I like the stuff pretty much, there's my toe, don't look at my toe, ah, okay, um, and, like, if you're doing this with it, it's kind of rough. And it, it's, like, sticky and it kind of hurts in some places. But, um, I love the little cloud. Hey, way. And, um, I know I can't feel it, which is a great thing. But, hold on. Let me put it in for a second. Okay. In there, what's, what are, okay, the things that are in these things are just, um, it's like foam, but it's really, like, disgusting textured foam. So, that's weird, but it, it, it's, it's, uh, still my favorite. So, I'm gonna give this. And there might be a higher rating than this, but just, to me, this is, like, even though there might be higher ratings than this. So, I'm going to give it, like, an eight and a half. Okay, moving on to the next one. Huh, let's go with my DNA ball. Um, so, as I said before, I don't understand really the hype of it. Like, it's okay. Um, the rubber balls are really, uh, really weird textured for a squishy, or stress ball, whatever you want to call it. And you can't really hold it like this for a while, because it, 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 like, it's, gets uncomfortable after a while. Um, but, great quality. And if you like things like this, then, um, this is perfect for you. Um... Um, and there's a lot of, there's not that much blue, only a little bit of blue, a lot of yellow, and, um, pink. That's what it mostly fills up with. Um, so I'm gonna give this probably like a six. Yeah. Okay, this. Not the monkey. The wiggle one. Okay, hold on, let me just eat this for you. Mm. How do I get this thing off? Something's not working right. Okay, so this is my wiggle worm, and um, it means a lot to me, because it got it for me for my birthday. Um, it is deflated, but it's still really fun to play with. Because it's stretchy, and it still has a little strings on it. And his eyes were coming off, like, a lot. So I just peel, like, the rest of the access. So it's just those things. Um, it's still really fun to play with. 
kind of like it better deflated. But when it wasn't, when it was inflated, it was like squishy. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. It was, um, it was exactly like this. Just in, as a worm. So I'm going to give this a 9. And this koala squishy. Oh my gosh. Before my Nita's and my DNA ball, this was my only squishy, so I was obsessed with it. Because I always wanted like something just squishy. So, and I still love it. Still one of my favorites. So I'm going to give it... It's hair and it's stuck in a while, so. so let's see. I shall give it also a nine. Okay. Okay, next we have the monkey noodle. Let's get it. Okay, most of you, oh, hopefully some of you now, at least some of you, know that I like blue fidgets better than I do other colored fidgets. But that's just because, like, it's still colorful and vibrant, but, um, it's, like, dark and not, like, in your face, like, neon. So, I like blue, uh, blue fidgets better. Um, as you can see in my collection, I am obsessed with, like, darker colored fidgets. Um, so, I like this one more than this one. And... So much that this one's not for trade, and this one is for trade, even though my brother wants me to keep this one, and he can, he, it's okay with me putting this one, but, um, because he thinks it's, like, green, but it's kind of green, it's more yellow. Anyway, so, uh, um, I don't really play with monkey noodles, because they have, like, it's, they're not the best, they're just, like, little stretchy toys. Um, but, so I'll give this one a five, I'll give this one a five and a half. Okay, next let's go on with all my pockets. Let's start on the bad side. <laughs> okay. So here are my puppets. And um, so here's the bad side of them. So of course this one, it's kind of loud, but you can't really hear it. And it has a weird texture when it's going down. So that side's okay, but what I love with this poppet is this is the only one I really do this to. This is so satisfying. And if I just do like three, that's okay. Um, the best thing to go like this with is that one's good side. Um, <clears throat> so I'm going to give this pop it, and it goes in the dark, and it's my favorite, it's like kind of my favorite color because it's like light blue, and I love blue, blue's my favorite color, sorry, but this is my favorite pop it, and I'll tell you why, and neat, um, so I'm going to give this, it glows in the dark really well, so... I'll give it an eight and a half. Okay. Moving on to this one. Um, so here's the back side. You can't hear it at all. And it's like really soft. And sometimes they come up. So that's not good. Um. That's, it's kind of loud, but. I like it because you can like hold it in your hand and just pop them and without like it's, it's kind of it's not really a distraction 
Um, so I'm gonna give this one, like, maybe, like, a seven. Okay, moving on. To the next one. This is my favorite one for, um, actual, like, popping sound. Because that, uh, in my opinion, sounds like slime. On the soft side, very soft. Um... And this is the loud side. Oh my gosh, it's so loud. This is the loudest. Okay, so I'm going to give this one, um, like, a nine. Because if you do this, the bad side's not that bad. Okay, um, and now here's the turtle. So this is my first poppet, and it's one of my first fidgets. So, but listen, this is the soft side. And then here's the loud side. It, it kind of feels like said because it's just so rubbery. Like, those are made of rubber, the other poppets. But, like, this one's, like, really extra, like, rubbery. So it kind of sounds like slime. When you're poking it. But yeah. Uh, oh. I have to rate these two. Oh, I already rated this one. I gave it a 9. This one, I'm going to give a 9 as well. Because it kind of hurts on your fingers when you're going down. On these things, because they're very textured. Um. Okay, Nido's are just my favorite for on the go. And I love these colors. They're perfect. Because we got a little bit of color. Then we got blue and green. So, these act like, like light colors. These act like cold colors. And this is a carrot. Or a pumpkin. And these together, because it's like neon and dark. And then when you squeeze them, also they stick together very well. When you squeeze them, they're just a little bit of light colors. And they have great texture, and I can just do this all day until my hand literally gets tired and purple. Um, <laughs> but I love these, so I'm going to give these 10 out of 10. These are definitely like one of my favorite. I can't put them in favorite ratings because I love them all. But I'm gonna give these 10 out of 10, all of them. Just amazing quality and great colors for what I got. I'm so happy I got these colors. Okay, enemies. Okay. Split them up in piles for trading. Marble mesh. Um. Not a great sound. I know in the ASMR video, video they had amazing sound. But I can't do it right now. Um, for whatever reason. And what I love about them is that you can either make them really skinny or you can make them really fat. And these used to be my favorite fidgets. Until I got a lot more. Um, cause I just, I loved Marble Mesh. Because um, you can just pull them up and pull them down. I just loved Marble Mesh. They're okay now. They're like little, little toys. Just tiny toys. Um, and the only ones I'm trading are these though. Because this is my favorite one in design. And this is my favorite one just like in pattern and all. 
I love this one. It's my favorite marble mesh. Um, and it has very great texture. It's very plasticky. <laughs> uh, it just has great, smooth, light texture. Um, so I'm going to give these... Oh, this is my least favorite just because of the colors. Um, so I'm going to give these like a six. Okay, moving on. Let's go with my mochis. Where are they? Where's my gray cat? Gray cat mochi. Oh, there they are. Okay. So here are my mochis. Um, the unicorn is my least favorite. No, the panda is my least favorite. Unicorns. I'm gonna put them in order, probably should like. So first, second, third, and fourth. I love this one even though those are like neutral colors and I love neutral colors. It's just this one is best textured and it gets least dirty. The thing I hate with mochis, and I'm pretty sure everyone can uh like relate to this, um, is how fast they get dirty. They got a little fuzzes on them right now. Um, probably because of this rug, but whatever. Um, so I'm gonna give this one for fidgeting like uh, maybe like five. I'm gonna give this one. I love this one because of how fat he is. You can just me. And now my hand hurts because of how much I've been fidgeting. Ow. Okay. Unicorn one is not stretchy at all and has very no, I think this is my least favorite. Yeah, this is my least favorite. And the panda's ear is now under him. Um, so I just have to fix his ear. And yes, I've been keeping track of his ear for a very long time now. Um because it just fell off like two weeks ago. So, that's great. There we go, he's fixed. He's a little stretchy. This one's very stretchy. This one's not stretchy at all, and it's not very good to do that. It's just, for looks, I guess, it's a little squishy, but. Um, so, five, five, three, one. Yeah, I really don't like the unicorn fidget. I am 100% trading that. Um, any offers? <laughs> no? Okay. Okay, there goes you and you and you. And there goes you, you too. Um, Rubik's Cube. I can't solve it, so I'm extremely frustrated with it. Great sounds. So I'm gonna give it a nice little four. My tea turtles, um, very squishy. It, it, it's great folding. That one has a keychain, so it's cool and it's small. And this one's black. I love the black. This is my my mom's favorites. Um, it doesn't make great sound. Um, so I'm gonna give this one a six. That one a six as well. Okay, now time for me featured beaters. Okay, I love when you rub these together to make like this sound. And they have great sound when they when they spin. This one on the other hand. This is I think this is the only thing that amuses me by it. Um I traded it for something. I think it was very stupid though, because it was with a six year old in aftercare. And I think I got it worth it. Because I'm pretty sure it was like something small and broken. I would not trade like a monkey noodle for this. Um, which I probably did. But it was probably like a pink or red monkey noodle. Okay, anyways. Um, so I'm going to give this one a three. And the other two. Oh my gosh, I love this like it's going back but it's going forward see it's 
going for the whole time. And so I love that one, so I'm going to give that one a four. I'm going to give this one a four as well. Okay. Um, we don't really have anything left except for my broken infinity cube. Um, I love the sound. Um, it's broken, but I'm going to get another one. So. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to give it, like, a four as well. Mini Pop Tube. And this is not the Mini Pop Tube you're thinking of. This is, like, miniature. 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 Like, Mini Pop Tube is probably, like, two of these. Like, this is very tiny, like, compared to my hand. Uh, great sound. But, uh, I don't really use it as much. And I'm definitely trading this. People had really great offers at school. And they think that, like, this pop tube and the DNA ball are, like, legendary. Um, so I'm gonna give that a full five, 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 okay. Next is the bike chain. I love this bike chain. Like, I used to hate bike chains, but then, you know, it's great. Um, and if you don't, then you don't. It's for me to know and for you to find out. Um, yeah, uh, I had to figure out how to love bike chains, so I accepted and... Well, I had to start playing with it first and getting used to it, and now I love it. So, I'm gonna give it, like, an eight. Okay, and I think, lastly, we have the Wacky Track. Um, I love making the Wacky Track into snappers. That's, like, my favorite thing to do with these. And I also love straightening them out. It's just so satisfying to me. So satisfying. So. Um, so, in that case, I'm gonna give it a good old seven. Um. Yeah. Those are all my fidgets. Um. Yeah, stay sweet. Bye, cookies.